Hey, it's uh, November 5th. We're back down here um, where I shot that doe where Brooke got too cold and had to leave the stand. We don't have to worry about that today, do we? Yeah. What's, what's the temperature today? 60 degrees. 65 degrees. It's warm. Um, I hunted down here the other day and uh, had a nice eight pointer go by and I was using my recurve and he was just out of range. I don't even know if you can see him in the, in the camera. I had my 360 camera going, but they cut the beans and corn, so we're not going to hunt the top uh, this time around. We're going to head down into the bottom in the valley and uh, try to get in a location. I think the deer are kind of going back and forth. It's November 5th, like I said, so I might get some rut action. I'm going to grunt some, maybe rattle a little bit and uh, see what we can do. Just got to let it we just got to bump it so we can get we can't sit here and watch this deer on the it's just gonna stand there we're gonna, we're gonna get this tree right here Settled in. I'm a little out of breath because I've been rushing to get set up. 
we got down here and uh, saw a doe. And uh, we were just gonna watch her and see if she'd come by, but then she bedded down. So instead of waiting on her to, to do what she's gonna do, we just tried to make a sneak on her, but she saw us as soon as we started moving. Anyway, we got down here where we wanted to hunt. We got to the base of the tree, two bucks busted out of here. I don't know if they were bedded or just standing over there tending to a doe or what was going on. But at any rate, a nice wide eight pointer ran off that way. And another buck went that way and I didn't quite see what it was, but that's a pretty good sign to have all those deer, but we're settled in now. Let's see what time it is. 3.30, we got two hours. It's okay, sweetie. What happened? What'd you hit? The ground. I mean, like it went. It hit something and deflected. No, I can't shoot nothing. It just went. I don't even see your arrow. I see it right there. It's on there. I wonder what it hit. It's almost like it. You didn't have it fully drawn or something. I don't know. Yeah, it just went. It went goof. Straight down. Fun, huh? Yeah. Bro, I couldn't even hold the camera. 
Sometimes still I was shaking so bad. Especially when he looked up. It was just my old lady. I was like this. I like this. You had the, you had the shakes on your leg. Like this. Let me see how, how, how was it? My foot was right here hanging up there. <laughs> That's the same thing that happens to me. Good job. You did a good job pulling it off and getting a shot. Was slightly cornered too, but if you could have got right there behind the shoulder, would have. I did, and like I said, it was like right in front of like where they, I, I know, mean, that's why I said. And then I, like, it had it like right behind. Yeah. I can see them. I'm still like, shaking. But it was right behind like the blade of his shoulder, like the yeah. shadow of it, or the groove of it. Yeah, that'd been a perfect shot. I just got to go would. back and look and see what happened to that arrow. Yeah. I just got through grunting and doing the bleats. And Brooke stood up and was talking to me. I was asking her, does she think she could shoot through this gap here? This gap right here between the trees. Yeah, I can. And, uh, and as she's looking at me talking, she's like, oh, a deer right there. Here come a nice buck. That looked like the same one that ran up earlier. I told you. He's coming down. All right, let's go look at this arrow. You're not even close to it, Brooke. It's over here. Yeah, so the buck was standing right up under this tree. Yeah, it's in the ground. Is it? Yeah. Is blood? Blood is blood. No, that's your knock. Oh, where did the arrow go? Oh. There's your arrow. Yeah. So it did go. Oh. And it was right here where the buck was standing. we got to figure out why this knock came out. Because it did, um, because I thought I had it secure. It came out earlier. That? Well, look at that. I mean, that jugger's stuck in the ground pretty good. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> Whoa. That's pretty good. You just missed it. Yeah. That is my fault. Right. You're a bad shot. That's funny. <laughs> All right, well, we'll go look at the footage. That, that knock really threw us off. I, I, got, thought I, I thought I had that thing secure where it wouldn't come out because it did it one time when we were target, target practice and I used a plastic bag to grocery bag. Oh, that <laughs> fell. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to go back and review the footage and figure out how close she was to hitting it because there's obviously no blood on it. And uh, we saw the light knock and we, that's why it looked like there was no oomph. All right, Brooke wants to collect some stream water to, for a science project, and then we'll uh, we'll head to the house. You got to turn it the other way. Which way is the water flowing? Don't pour it upstream. Use some common sense, girl. Obviously. All right, let's play. Put the cap on. Let's go. You've been complaining you're cold all evening. Let's go.